Hi everyone, I hope you had a fantastic weekend. At Supermums this week, we are talking about how to be an awesome admin. We're wrapping up this four part series that we've been doing. And this week we're talking about what you should be doing in the first four weeks of your Salesforce admin role. We have many admins that qualify with us at Supermums and land their first job. And then it's like, oh my God, this panic of like, what am I gonna do? What do I do first? And quite often we can be quite reactive to what people want us to do. And we can dive into building things and not really understand what the organization does, what its priorities are. And quite quickly, you can find yourself in a firefighting type situation where you are just responding to things, you don't really know the big picture, you feel out of your depth, and that can quite quickly lead to burnout as well. So I wanted to put together seven tips for you to think about, actually, how do I start this new job with confidence, with the right foundations to really understand what it is that I should be doing, what the organization needs of a Salesforce system, what they've done already, what's working, what's not, what do the team do, and a lot of this is very much centered around some of those softer skill sets that you need around agile project management, business analysis and change management skills. And we call those consultancy skills. So check out the article, put your plan in place and start thinking about how you can approach this in a way that you're being proactive and you feel in control of it. Because quite often, if you are the solo admin, nobody's going to tell you what and how to do your job. They're going to be looking at you for your guidance and for you to manage the process in a way because nobody else will know what Salesforce is and they're really looking to you for that guidance. So feel that sense of authority, feel that sense of empowerment and feel like you're in control and work through the guidance that I've provided to help you feel like you know what you're doing. We also have a free download, which is our 40 task download and plus our health check download, which are free tools that you can use straight away to manage that implementation. And if you're going for that job interview, you can talk through this whole process as well. So you don't necessarily need to have landed that job. It's going to be a perfect sort of set of things that you can talk through at any interview that you're going for. Now, if you don't feel confident in some of those skills like business analysis, change management and agile project management, then I'd highly recommend that you book a slot on our consultancy skills course. It's going to equip you with all those key skills and a lot of different templates and tools that you're gonna to need to hit the ground running. We have a Black Friday deal coming up, which is gonna start on Thursday and land through to next uh, Wednesday, which will give you 20% off discount off our consultancy skills course that starts in January. So if you wanna get yourself prepared, talk, start talking to an employer now, that's whether it's something they'll sponsor for you because we have a lot of trainees where their employer will sponsor them or go 50-50 on that consultancy course cost and fee um, so do find out more lean in we have a consultancy skills discovery session happening this thursday um, that will be recorded as well so if you download a consultancy skills pack and you want to find out more then tune into that watch the replay um, and you can find out more about the course in situ as well so i hope that's really useful for you in whatever capacity if we can help you upskill and fantastic do talk more to our team but enjoy the blog and the podcast welcome any feedback as always if you liked it do please reach out to me as a dm or share it and like it on the, the social media platform in which you're reading it so have a fantastic week everyone speak to you soon take care bye